hey guys welcome back to another video in today's video i will be showing you how to create your ircc portal in order to apply for a canada visitor visa so if you are interested in seeing that please watch this video don't forget to hit like drop a comment subscribe to the channel if you are new share this video with everybody you may find useful In the past, they used the GC key login, but recently they started using the IRCC portal. So to access that, you just go on the website that you saw there, click on the second option, which will take you to this page. On this page, you can see the option apply online, which is what you will be selecting. When you select apply online, you just scroll down and right there that's highlighted, it will tell you the documents that you need and depending on what you're applying for you will use the ircc portal so again that's for reference and all these options i've tried all of them and when i scroll all the way to the bottom it takes me to the ircc portal because i wanted to see if it will lead me to the gc key login but none of them took me there so in fact it is the ircc portal that they're using for these options so when you click on the one that you want in this case we will be using applying to visit a family member clicking that option will tell you the documents you need and the instructions in order to apply so i'm going to select family member visit and when you scroll con when you click continue and scroll all the way down you have to sign into the ircc portal however in this case since we are just creating one when we click on it this is what will come up and again these are the applications that you will use the ircc portals for so on it we are applying to visit a family member who is a permanent resident in canada so after we scroll down we are going to select the option get invite code and then we are going to put in our email address then we confirm it below and after that we're going to select get invitation code which will be sent to your email then this is a page that you will fill out after and this is pretty straightforward it's just asking you information about yourself and then you click sign up to get another code to your email address that you will input there along with your email address and then you click confirm voila the account is created now it's time to log back into your account so you're going to put back the same email address that you used and the password that you created on the previous page click sign in then you have to read through these terms and conditions if you agree you click accept and then you will be in your ircc portal account that you can use to apply for your visa so these pop-up boxes in yellow are basically telling you what the new ircc portal is about and the applications that you can use it to access so after you read through everything you can go ahead and click them off using the x at the top right hand corner after that you are going to now select start an application apply to visit study or work in canada as a temporary resident since we are applying for a canada visitor visa but if you scroll down the page you can see if you have started an application or if you have any message that they sent to you when you click that option it will load this page that you are seeing here which will give you some information about the rules um, that you should check before you start your application instructions that you need to follow to complete your applications and it also tells you that you have 60 days to complete an application that you have started before it's automatically deleted after that you select start an application and that is it thank you guys so much for watching this video again please like comment share and subscribe to the channel bye